the place where Jesus was born. Now, if you look at this ball, it was, you see up there, this is a huge building. The stone is a local stone as we saw everywhere. Now, this is the first entrance that you believe in, the Byzantine entrance. The church, this church was not destroyed in the uh, Muslim time, in the beginning of the Persian uh, time. I'm talking about the 7th century, when Islam is starting to <coughs> rise. And the Pers there was a huge invasion of Persian to this area, and they did not touch the site. Uh, it was never destroyed. Why? Do you remember the story of the three magos? They came from Persia. Okay. It's not written Persia, it's written East. They came from the East and they were here. So because of them, the Persians in the time of the Muslim uh, taking over, they did not touch the church. So it was lucky enough to go on. Now, this church, as I told you, first was first built in the Byzantine time. When was it destroyed? After the Persian, in the begin, in the by the uh, mid of the Muslim period, which means in the eighth century. And then they built this mosque. You see? You see? Now they also built a mosque by the church inside, which was destroyed later. Now came the, after the Muslims came the Crusaders. Crusaders, uh, it means Christians. They came from Europe, Europe in the 11th century. They stayed here in this area for 200 years. They were ruling the area and they rebuilt the church. Now they built a smaller entrance. This is it. You see? Then came the Turks, Ottoman time, Ottoman time. In the Ottoman time, there was a clash between the Greek Orthodox Church, the Catholic Church, the Armenian Church, and all the other denominations. They were fighting. Most of the church was in the hands of the Catholic Church. But let me remind you, where is the center of the Greek Orthodox Church? In Pushta, Istanbul, right? So they were in charge. So the Turks <coughs> let the Greek Orthodox all over. So about 90% of the total church is in the hands of the Greek Orthodox. 7% in the hands of the Armenians. 3% Catholic. Down there, we'll see it. The question is, with this much uh, door, in the Turkey period when the Greek Orthodox were ruling, they decided to make the uh, door as small as possible so that you can bend down and honor the site. So please, I'm not Christian, I beg you, do not take pictures looking out and you're back to the church, just for the honor of the church. Okay, okay? That's how usually tourists do. I just beg you not to do it. That's it. <laughs> it's a habit door. per andare là dietro e siamo da dietro
All these guys aren't moving. That's pass. How much do you think you pay? What's in there? Yeah,
side of the mosaic here. Just by the door. I didn't know what to expect. Uh, what could you expect? Nothing. But you saw the star, you saw it all. Yeah, it's so warm down there. <laughs> yeah. Go to the other side of this and say, try the door and wait for me, please. Okay, yeah. Are you okay, Anne? Okay. Just stand. Get closer. Roger, wait, Roger, wait. You too. You too. Come on. Come on, look at me. There's a horse statue, Tiffany. Over here. And a knight in shiny armor. Thank you. 
Ceea ce...